channel nancy here and welcome back to my channel i'm so excited to be back for another video like always please just go ahead and make sure you subscribe y'all before i get to this video let me just tell you i was searching instacart shopper just on youtube and y'all my name came up as a search word if you go to instacart shopper it says instacart shopper nancy and i'm like am i like the instacart shopper girl like that's so crazy and like i had a friend that lives in atlanta and they were like yeah nancy like they look at people talking about your instacart videos girl people like go watch her instacart video go watch i'm like what is happening all right hey instacart go ahead cut me a check <laughs> anyways um so back to what i was saying about the uh title of the video which was do i feel like instacart is worth it in 2023 in short answer yes i do believe that instacart is worth it in 2023 um, I think this question comes from people who are on the wait list who kind of want to know, like, is it even worth staying on the wait list? Should I just go ahead and take myself off? Um, I believe that Instacart is definitely still worth it. There's so much room to make income. There's a lot of, you know, with the new feature they're adding, there's room to, you know, add people as regulars, you know, um, which is great. And I believe that there's even like Instacart is even adding new stores. Instacart is getting new customers they're growing every single day like instacart i'm telling you instacart is booming they're even hiring people um and so yeah i would just say that of course instacart is definitely worth it it's only going to grow it's going to get better and with that they're going to need more shoppers if they get higher demand of customers and all the different stuff in certain areas so the people were talking about you know with the gas prices and things like that gas is not as expensive as it was uh, a year or two ago I fill up my tank with i'll just give an example 45 dollars 50 dollars for that week or for the yeah for that week and then i can make 500 dollars wouldn't you say that that's worth it i would think so you know i mean so that's basically uh how i look at it you know i know some people who make 200 dollars a day you know um it's really just about like i said your your outlook on it and i feel like the only person that can answer whether or not instacart is worth it is you because i i really believe it sounds so cliche but when people used to say you get out what you put in i i really believe instacart is a great example of that you know it is frustrating sometimes when you have to you know you don't have all these batches lined up if you live in an area was not like you know as booming it could be frustrating when you wait hours for a batch or whatever but that's why you have to sometimes people do like multi-batching as well i'm sorry not multi-batching multi-apps different apps and things of that nature i know some people who do other things outside of instacart you can also pick up hobbies or things that you're doing while you're waiting or um but i typically don't have a lot of wait time in between batches because I look at the map and I go to areas where they say this is a high volume store, you know, and when I go to those stores, usually it's usually back to back to back to back to back to back to back. And I don't like to give myself too much space in between batches. I like to kind of just get in a, like I told you in my other video, I like to just get in a rhythm, get in a rhythm. And I don't, sometimes, you know, for me, I like to go to stores I'm not familiar with, but sometimes I will go to a store I'm not familiar with if it's a smaller size batch. Um, so yeah, it's just, you just kind of have to pick and choose, you know, you kind of have to pick and choose the batches. There was a series where I did see that there were a lot of customers, like, um, it was like maybe three days ago, a lot of customers, it was on that day. I'm not sure if it was something going on with Instacart and customers couldn't leave tips, but like a lot of batches were like no tip, no tip. And y'all know, I don't take any batches that say no tip. So I was just like, mm, what's going on? You know, it was just, I've never seen it like that before. So maybe it was a glitch or something. I don't know. But that's basically it. To end, yeah. So Instacart is definitely worth it. I've met some great people. Even the employees are so cool. They help me. I'm like, hey, <laughs> if I have a if I have a list of like 13, 12 things, I'm like, hey, come here. Where is this, please? Okay. Are you busy? You want to go grab it for me? <laughs> and some of them will do it. Like it's you know so it's just it's just some of the stores it's really really nice employees it, it is what you make it it's what you make it and i always say look at the brights look at the the good that comes out of it you know if instacart is a way for you to supplement income you know extra income that you might need for whatever whether it's i don't know your light bill your phone bill um anything 
you know think about like that to me is a blessing that's a blessing whether or not you might look at it as a blessing for me i look at it as a blessing you know so i never want to take um take it for granted to all of the current instacart shoppers keep crushing it to all the future instacart shoppers crush it and you know that's all i want to say to you guys thank you so much for watching this video i will see you guys in my next video bye